Forgiveness means you've been healed of the pain. Hebrews chapter 12 verses 14 and 15. Pursue peace with all people and holiness without which no one will see the Lord. Looking carefully, lest anyone fall short of the grace of God, lest any root of bitterness springing up cause trouble, and by this many become defiled. Verse 14 is dealing with human relationships. It's talking about pursuing peace with one another, pursuing peace in human relationships. And in connection to this, the writer of Hebrews tells us that we need to be watchful, we need to be alert, we need to be careful about something. He says, don't fall short of God's grace. That means here you are, you're, you're walking in peace in your relationships, but here is something that could cause you to miss the very grace of God in your life, to miss the working of God's grace. And what is it? He says, any root of bitterness springs up and causes trouble. So he says, make sure that as you are pursuing peace with all people and walking in holiness before God, don't let any bitterness come into your heart because if it comes in, it will spring up. That means it's going to grow into something which will cause trouble, it will cause you trouble and others will also become defiled because it will affect people around you. Now, why is this important? Because if we don't forgive and we don't forgive, we are only creating an environment for bitterness and bitterness will grow and it will affect us and it will affect people around us. But when we forgive people, when we uh, release forgiveness so that we can walk in peace with all people, then bitterness no longer exists in us. F releasing forgiveness is a sure pathway to healing and wholeness on the inside of us. When you, are, when you have really released forgiveness to people, there will no longer be any bitterness in your heart towards that person. So you'll be able to look at that person eye to eye. You can shake hands with that person. You can laugh with that person. You can have peaceful interaction, joyful interaction with that person. You're pursuing peace in that relationship. Bitterness no longer is affecting you or affecting the, the, your relationship with that person. So how can you know that you've really forgiven somebody and there is no bitterness in your heart and you're able to have peaceful interactions with that person once again? Pursue peace. Get rid of bitterness. Forgive. Let's pray. Lord, we ask that you will help us do this. Help us to keep our hearts free from all bitterness, to be healed of all the hurt and the pain, even as we extend forgiveness in Jesus name. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.